Lombardi, and Miss Lombardi said, the harder you work, the harder it is to surrender. The harder you work, the hard, listen to me. And, and this is the thing I love about this sport. Like, like when you go in there, you both want the exact same thing. Nobody goes in there to lose. You both want the exact same thing. You both got family out there. You both got friends out there. You, go, you both got people who uh, invested their time and their resources and their wisdom. And they, you both got guys out there who at the end of the day want to smile. But, but, but at the end of the day, the person that will surrender is the person that didn't work as hard as the other person. You gotta hear what I'm saying, guys. You got everybody goes in there. Y'all got the same, for real. Y'all got the same access to the same. I guarantee you, if I go to my man's gym, it, it probably looks similar to this. I guarantee you that his trainer is saying he did this and he did that, he did this and he did that. I guarantee you that this person didn't just start doing this for the first time. And some of you in here, you on the upswing, like for real. You 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 trying to get back. You're trying to get back to a certain place. You're trying, to, you're trying to make a name for yourself. And I'm telling you, this is the opportunity to do it, but what do you have to do? You gotta work harder than the other person. So just when you felt like you did that last rep and your muscles are saying, When the rat score, he don't say nothing. He ain't getting nobody excited. He ain't, he ain't trying to get LeBron pissed off or pumped up. He just scoring my man and shh. Only thing he does at the end of the game, he kisses his mama, he hugs his brothers. All right, I'm out. Game over. Shh. But the one thing he does, I don't know if you watched it, the first thing he does when he gets on the court is he does what? Y'all better start watching these games, bro, because you're going to need to do what these champions are doing if you're going to be a champion. The first thing he does is what with them numbers? Touch them numbers on the front. Touch them numbers on the back. And he's doing that for who? Which coach? His coach that was killed. His coach died at what age? And he wears what number? He got a why. He got a why. He ain't just playing for no championship. He not, you gotta hear what I'm telling you. If y'all gonna be great on that field, you gotta have a why. You gotta have a reason for why you do what you do. When, when he comes out, he ain't tripping on LeBron. He, ain't, he don't care nothing about no Dwayne Wade. All he keeps thinking about is, I'm gonna get one for my coach. That's why he ain't all smiling, because why? He's not smiling because what he's trying to accomplish, he has not what? He ain't got it yet. He ain't geeked about winning no game. He not geeked about beating San Antonio. He not tripping because they up one game. That boy, and you ain't gonna see that boy smile until he get the championship, and when he get it, he gonna hold up. The problem with some of y'all, the reason why you don't give 120% every doggone time you get on the field, because you ain't got a why for what you do. You ain't got a why. I walk in the room, I can see some of y'all. I spoke to all of y'all when y'all came in for the most part. Why? Because I'm looking in your eyes and I see some of y'all and you ain't serious. And you think you about to go out there with the Ray Lewis of the world? Nigga, please, when Ray come out, you see the passion. Every game, you see the energy. He come out every game like, y'all follow me. Follow my lead, baby, and we gonna win this thing. What's your why? I, if, hey, if I don't give y'all nothing else, you better start that. What's your why? You know why I do what I do and I do it so passionately? Because my grandfather was a high school dropout. My father was a high school dropout. I was a high school dropout. And we about to break the cycle. I do what I do so my son won't have to go through what I went through. When I was at the football game, my old dude wasn't with me. I saw other kids with they fought. I said, that'll never happen to me. I do what I do because my daughter says she's going to Harvard. It ain't even about y'all. I'm about to come in here and blaze y'all. Why? Because I'm trying to get you all the NFL. I ain't about to miss this opportunity. This is the first NFL team I've ever done in my life, and I'm about to lick it. I'm about to give everything I got, and I will know if I don't get another gig, it won't have nothing to do with the fact that I didn't put everything on the field. What's your why? Why do you wake up in the morning? Why do you put on that jersey? Why do you Sam!